Hi, so today I'm going to show you how to do the bubble background. Now we're outside, so I do apologise for any noises of birds. Um, all we're going to be using is these bubble tubes. You can get an eight pack from Kmart for about $2 in the party section. And we're going to be using our increased stampers. So all you do is pop, I might open my ink first. So you just pop the top off here and add about seven drops Oops. seven drops into it now anything that this touches it's going to stain um, anything porous it touches it's going to stain and we just want to mix I've got it all over my hands now and I didn't bring anything out to wipe it We're just going to mix the colour in into the tube. Come on, up you come. Just going to mix the colour down into the bubble wand, into the bubble mixture. And then we grab, I've just got our Whisper White cardstock. And all we need to do is blow bubbles on it. So make sure you do this outside. Because anything that this bubble mixture touches will stain it. Just going to see if my mixture, oh, my ink's not really. Might put a couple more drops in this one. It's not getting the brightness that I want to see. Oops. That's what we want. And you just go and keep going until you get whatever. <laughs> texture or not whatever the amount of bubbles you want. One splattering a lot today. Let's try this. Ah, oh, there you go. I need to hold it up a little bit. I think that's enough for today. So that is how you do a bubble background. Then you just cut it down to whatever size you want for your card. Just make sure that anywhere you do it, you're wearing old clothes um, because it will stain. As you can see, I slopped it on my hands. So and I have pretty purple hands. Um, and just pop any bubbles. If you find that you need to wait for it to dry, you can put it on a um, heat, heat gun on to dry. But with the Whisper White cardstock, it dries pretty quickly. Thanks for watching.